right, so this is our second annual Children's Mental Health and Wellness Fair. We are out here as a student services department of Cumberland County School, and we have two main purposes. One is we want to work against the stigma around mental health, and number two, we want to link the families and communities to service providers that are, and all the services that are available in the community. And I guess there's a third one too. We just want people to have fun. I loved all the talks, um, all of the different stations. Everybody's been so nice. The kids have gotten involved. They've been able to play games. Uh, to be able to talk about the different resources and what's, what's out there, what's available, that's been phenomenal. And the walk was great. Uh, we actually like met and were able to talk to people while we were on the walk. Uh, it's beautiful downtown Fayetteville. Um, it's a little warm, but the walk itself was shaded. So it was all in all just a great Saturday morning. Um, my goal for this event as a volunteer is just to learn more and help in any way I can because you can never stop helping and mental health is really important so I want everyone to be able to get that information just so they can take it home and use it. It's so important. I feel like kids nowadays are really struggling. You've got social media. You have so many um, things that have occurred with, with the COVID and the epidemic. And kids and parents need to know what, what kind of resources do we have? What kind of options can we turn to? And I think knowing that you're not alone. My goal is to, one, have an opportunity as a department to connect with the community. Through the services, we consist of school counselors, school social workers, school psychologists. And so as much as we want the families to know about the services that are available in the community, we also want them to know, I need them to know, that in every school there's a counselor, social worker, psychologist, and a nurse that is available to assist students. So it's okay to not be okay, and we have a full staff that's available to assist students during the school day, and if we don't have the services in school, we also have the capacity to link it to the resources in the community.